Hi! I'm making a video, and I know I should have done that, like, last Friday, but I can be bothered, so... And I know that's bad, but... I also didn't have anything to talk about, and I do have stuff to talk about. Which is good. Um, so, yeah, let's get going. And that's why this video is going to be more fun than my last video, which you haven't seen because it's on my computer and it's totally crap, and that's why I'm shooting a new video, because I actually already shot a video on Sunday, and I edited it today, and then I decided, fuck that, it's silly, it's stupid, it's ugly, let's not do that. So, let's do something else. Look at my finger. I went to the Bookiverse. But I'll make another video about that, because I only have, like, three of the books here. And, um, it's not fun if you can't see all my books. But there are a lot, because I have a shopping bag full of them, which is awesome. <clears throat> so I did a couple of things. Today I went to, um, I went to the Friert store, which was, like, nice. And I got a movie. I actually was going to buy The Wall by Pink Floyd but they didn't have it, and I found something else that I've wanted ever since I saw it, so I'll show you. It's a movie. It's called First Polis, and as you can see, it's an animation. And, um... I bought it because I saw it at Lowlands, and we were actually going to see a different movie called uh, Larson Real Girl. I have still haven't seen that one, and I really should. But um, because we were really late, we weren't allowed into the cinema anymore. And um, so we went to the one next to it, and where we were allowed in after it started. And we missed, like, the first 30 minutes or something. But... Um, so yeah, that sucked. But we went in and we were pleasantly surprised because we really didn't know what to expect. But it was an animation and it was re it's drawn really simple, as you can see. Um, but it's really good. It's about this girl called Mariana. And um, she grew up during the war and revolution in Thailand in, uh, what was it, 1987, 78, that was it. And um, it's about her life then. And it's really good. It starts when she's like an eight-year-old girl and she gets into Judas Priest and she sings I Love the Tiger and it's brilliant. And I love it. And something's speaking in the background. And now it's not. And another thing I did today was... Well, I did, well another thing I did today was go to school, which was very interesting. Oh, yes, it is very interesting. Because yesterday I was sitting in art class and I was studying for uh, geography and it was like one of the few places where it was absolutely quiet. So um, this girl comes in called Natalie. She's in my class. And she was like, oh, I'm so going to screw up English tomorrow. We had a listening test. And she was like, I'm so going to screw up English tomorrow. And I was like, okay. And she was like, I need someone to help me. Look for it. Just get help me. And it was like, okay. What do I get in return? And she was like, you do it? You do it? Yes, I'll give you everything. I'll even give you an iPod. Well, I didn't get an iPod because I thought that was me. If she passes, I'm going to get Paper Towns by John Green. And she's going to, she already bought it, apparently. Because she has so much confidence in me. And it made me feel like, yeah. Um... But, um, yeah, I thought that was awesome. So I'm going to get a free book, and she's going to get a good grade, and we'll all be merry. So, yeah, a little arm work, being lucrative, speaking English quite well. Yes. It's a definite plus. So my Nerdfire skills, I used them for, well, a little greater good. A little not so great good. But still, awesome. Another thing I did, this was on Sunday, I downloaded an album by the Mountain Goats called Heretic Pride. And as I was listening to the music, uh, I thought up an idea. How about if I draw to the music, the music be my guide 
let him guide my hand. And, um, yeah, that was really awesome, and I got some lovely pictures. So I'll show them to you now. And I'll also let you hear the songs that I, they were drawn to. Are you ready? you enjoyed that little piece of um, artwork I did there. Always fun to do. And um, yeah, I rock. Well, I don't. It really sucks. But it was fun to do. I love you. Take a look, take a look at the kids on the street. No, I never miss a beat. No, I never miss a beat. Never miss a beat. Never miss a beat. Never miss a beat. Never miss a beat.